wait 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 before you grab any magnesium supplement you need to see this the difference between these could make or break your results this is dr yasin today i decided to talk about a different subject which is different forms of magnesium and how they are confusing for people let me blow your mind with absorption rates magnesium oxide 4 to 40 percent absorption only cheapest but worst absorbed Magnesium straight 90% the sweet spot for most people. Magnesium glycinate 80% best for sleep and sensitive stomach. Magnesium althurinate 60% the only one that reaches your brain. So here is exactly which one you should take based on your goal. So if you can't sleep take magnesium glycinate. The glycine molecule calms your nervous system. If you're getting migraines take magnesium oxide. I know it's weird but it works. So which one is better for focus? It's magnesium l -theranate. It actually crosses the brain and increases magnesium level in the brain. It should be taken twice a day. Just one general health, magnesium straight. Best bang for your bucks with 90% absorption. But here is what they don't tell you. Magnesium oxide gives 30% of people diarrhea, while magnesium glycine gives only 5% diarrhea. If your stomach hates you after taking magnesium, just switch forms. One more thing, 10% of magnesium supplements are contaminated with lead. Always look for a USP verified or NSF certified on the label. Your health is worth the extra few dollars. Save this post, screenshot the absorption rates and stop wasting money on the wrong magnesium. Which one are you going to try? Drop it in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching.